I'm here with Jen Cassetta, who is a stiletto and self-defense class expert. You have a defense class that's based on stilettos? Yes. Uh, it's called Stilettos and Self-Defense because uh, one night I was attacked in New York when I was living there. Um, but because of my martial arts training, I'm a third degree black belt in Hapkido, I was able to scare off my attacker and chase him down the street wearing my stilettos. That must have been terrifying. I mean, it, how scary was that? It was. I mean, wow. Yeah, it, it is terrifying, but I realized that I was able to do that, and most women can't you know, run in their stilettos, let alone, let alone walk sometimes. So I needed to create a program that empowered women to stand up to attackers and fight back. Got it. Great. Oh, we have an attacker? Yes. Yeah. Great. So here we have Logan. Safe. Is it, okay. <laughs> Logan, you're, you know, you're too cute to be an attacker. We need a scary attacker. He's not so scary. Oh my, all right, well, attack with your cuteness. All right. So, it's already working, I'm terrified by how cute you are. Okay. Right? Um, so sometimes, you know, if you're not paying attention, an attacker is gonna come up. Am I, I'm, I'm, the, I'm the one. Exactly. Okay. And uh, he's gonna come at you. All right. At me, right? I'm already home. Good. Oh. And he's gonna punch. Oh, I thought I was getting attacked. I was like, I'm home safely. Oh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> so, I'm in my bed eating all, you, you miss me. Exactly. So make sure you block your face, right? First thing, hands up. Second thing, I'm gonna come in close to him, right? And drive my knee right into his groin. Okay? So basically, this is the kick him in the balls class. Yes, but no, no, there's more to it than that. Okay. And then I'm gonna take my stiletto over to his knee and kick him down, and then finish, boom. From the front. Exactly. Mm -hmm. We have because another. the situation is you can't get out of it. You have to deal with what's going on right in front of you because you, you're ready. When someone catches you, you're not gonna. You can't get out. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. You're supposed to be you screaming too. You're supposed to use your voice, right? Scream, curse, do whatever you can. Okay. Yes. You okay. like it from behind. Excellent, Andy. <laughs> okay. That's my dirty producer. <laughs> Let's do it from behind. Great. So okay. from behind, um, I'm at my car. And someone grabs me. So the first thing I did was base out and drop my weight. Next thing, he's gonna want to cover your mouth from all the screaming. So I'm gonna bite down as hard as I can to get this hand off. Second thing, I can come in, boom, elbow him right in the gut. Using both Sorry. hands. I've heard that before. You're supposed to clap your hands. Boom. Both hands are stronger because right. one is like this, but you gotta get them together. Exactly. Yeah. She knows her stuff. Well, I took a class one time. Oh, good. Okay. Next, I can use my heel here, or I'm gonna turn into him and just, boom, right across the face. Why with with the, the elbow? elbow. Now, why with the elbow, not the hand? Because it's stronger. The elbow is stronger, and it's closer distance. Wow, you are. I wouldn't mess with her.